Okay, uh, famous people I've met. Okay, uh, Beach Boys, Rolling Stones, The Who, Johnny Crawford from The Rifleman, Evan Kemp, who was a country star around Vancouver. I'm just going down the list. Bob Hope uh, at the Palisades a few times. Chuck Berry, I played a gig with him at War Memorial. Ten years after, The Birds, Paul Revere and the Raiders, Johnny Winter, Steve Stills, Johnny Martino, Andy D. Martino, Weather Report, the uh, jazz band, Sonny Terry, Brownie McGee, Frankie Jean Lewis, Linda Gale Lewis, The Guess Who, Mother Tucker's Yellow Duck, Boz Skaggs, David Soule from Starsky and Hutch, Hoyt Axton, country singer, Ian Tyson, I met him, Gordon Lightfoot, met him, Trooper, uh, Prism, Seeds of Time, that's a band from Vancouver, Danny Tripper, Danny McGinnis from Fireweed, I've met a lot of the local guys, of course, Brave Belt, which was Randy Backman's band, uh, and uh, also uh, Backman Turner Overdrive, uh, did a gig with them, Powder Blues, Brian Adams, Bruce Allen, Craig McDowell from promoters in town here, Bruce Allen, who managed Brian Adams. Craig McDowell, who worked with Brian Adams later on too. Crowbar, Duras Maxwell, the drummer from town. Howard Steele, a producer from L.A. Jim Gaines, a producer from L.A. Uh, from L.A., who worked with uh, Steve Ray Vaughan, Santana, and all those people. Um, Country Joe, from Country Joe and the Fish. Set, who was a local guy but made it sort of big. Kenny Lovelace, who's Jerry Lee's uh, guitar player. Um, and these are different uh, biker gangs. I'm just including them right now. Uh, big Mike the Snaws, he was the president of the Hells Angels in the East End. 101 Nights, the Rebels, the Tribesmen from... Uh, the Rebels are from Edmonton and uh, Saskatoon. 101 Nights were from Powell River. Tribesmen from Squamish. Uh, Rebels had a guy named Tiny. He was a big guy. He used to look out for us and went in Edmonton at the Kingsway Hotel. Buddy Knox. Wally Hyde, the silver mine owner. Val Coppola, a crane owner. Of course, my friend West, the entire West Coast. Sid Sharp, the guy from the Los Angeles Philharmonic. Uh, Al Gallico, the guy that brought you... Uh, uh, 250. He had 50, 250 gold records or something. Jimmy Haskell had 150 gold records. He was my arranger. Al Gallico was involved in in, in uh, publishing. Uh, Ron Malo, the engineer at Devonshire. West Dacus up in Edmonton from West Dacus and the Rebels. Barry Allen. Les Vogt, who was a promoter in Vancouver and also a star from The Blamers. He put out that song. Uh, Don Hunter was a guy I met up in Watson Lake. He was, uh, I think he was in the legislature up there or something. He was quite the character. Uh, Daryl B., all these DJs I met. Daryl B., Roy Hennessy, Fred Latrimo, Rick Honey. Met Paul Horn, Warren Beatty, Julie Christie, Long John Baldry, uh, Johnny Crawford from The Rifleman, I think I mentioned him. Um... Johnny Martino, okay, Frankie. Let me jump. Uh, the Birds, I met them. Um, who else? No. Crowbar, that's another band I, I met. Um, they were a big band in Vancouver, or I'm in Canada. Um, Paul Horn, Beach Boys, yep, Beach Boys. Okay, that's good. Acts that I've gone and seen, just as a few of them that are big acts, were Moody Blues, I've seen them. I've seen ZZ Top, I've seen Joni Mitchell, The Cream, Joan Baez, uh, John Hammond, Jose Feliciano, Liberace, Glenn Campbell, Fats Domino, Jerry Lee Lewis a bunch of times, Buddy Rich, Wayne Newton, Canned Heat, Little Richard, Buddy Knox, I've seen all those ones. Um... Okay, that's it for now.